This is our annual Back to School Community Fest and it's hosted by the Downtown Newport News Merchant and Neighbors Association and the James A. Fields House and all of our community partners that have donated to make this a great event for us today. 39, Ellis Family of Five. Number one, number one. Each child that comes to the Community Fall Fest today will actually get a back to school backpack with school supplies in it. Our theme is equipping our students for school success. And so what we want to do from the community is to try to provide them with some of the basic school supplies that they will need for the school year. We understand that one organization cannot do it all, but we want to try to be part of what we give back to the community for our children. I have one in it. I put one in for you. It's in your bag. Uh, we have several people from our community have, that have partnered with us today. Um, to help bring recognition and information out to the community and education because that's what it's all about. We want to try to make sure that we're educating our community while we have fun doing it at the same time. So what I'm here to do today is we're going to pick five tickets. Eight, zero, seven, zero. Six, three, one, eighty, seventy. Hey. Hey. It is eight, zero, five, nine. I must have been oh, mouse. Oh, that's what I'm talking about. Day. Yes, We're having fun. Yes. It's uh, the fourth annual Mayor's Play Ball event. It's kind of been an annual event. I've done this now uh, all four years, uh, that we, or at least I think it was the th three years we've had the dunk tank. So, uh, yeah, we've done it every year. <laughs> What they do is each of the kids gets a card, and there are three stations that they go to. They can go to the batting, where, where there's on the tee ball, they hit the ball and they measure the distance, they hit it. They can run bases and they time them. And then there's a pitching target also over there. So once they go through all three stations, they go back over to the tent and they get prizes. And then in between all that, we've got uh, blow-ups for them to participate in. They could do the dunk tank, free food, free hot dogs. Uh, so all, that, all that's really good. It, there was a partnership uh, between the Baseball League and the U.S. Conference of Mayors. Uh, one of the guys actually who is a, a mayor that I know, former mayor of Teaneck, New Jersey, and went to Hampton Institute also, um, now works for the uh, Baseball League, uh, wanted to try and get more minorities into baseball because they had actually fewer and fewer minorities are playing. And kids in general, uh, baseball is probably not their first choice. So we're trying to get kids back interested in baseball. And. Uh, this is one way of doing it. Whoa. Having the mayor of the duct tank, probably more for the parents than the kids. <laughs> it's something they want to see. Yeah, I just tease the kids and talk about how, ah, that, you, no way you can do it, no way you can do it. And uh, the girls are actually pretty good at it. <laughs> they really are. Today we have Stuff the Bus. It's a promotion that we've done to assist all the children in the area because no kid should start school without the proper supplies. We feel like since we're a community store, we need to give back and do something for the community. Uh, this is something that uh, we came up with a $5 donation bag. And this way people could help out by just dropping off, uh, a do buying a donation bag, dropping it off in the bin. And then we put together the Stuff the Bus program here at Piggly Wiggly and all the proceeds can go to the local schools to help the local children start school with the proper equipment that they need. Okay.